Whatever campaigns Marcus had planned afterwards against the remaining hostile tribes were cancelled, as there had been a rebellion in the eastern provinces led by the veteran general of the Parthian War, Avidius Cassius. Cassius had received news from Marcus Aurelius' wife Faustina that Marcus was inevitably going to die while campaigning due to his ailing health, and thus he declared himself emperor in order to try and prevent civil war. The Senate thus proclaimed Cassius an enemy of the state, and before any battle could commence against Marcus and Cassius, a centurion had killed Cassius and sent his head to Marcus, who refused to even see it. Marcus also had no desire to purge any of Cassius' supporters. After this was done, Marcus finally returned to Rome for the first time after nearly eight years. On December 23, 176 AD, a joint triumph was held for him and his son and heir Commodus. The Aurelian Column was erected to commemorate the victory.